this is this even real i've been flying from town to town from london to taiwan i've been all around the globe trying to protect your soul what's up waterboy gang so guess what i'm currently doing I'm on my two week drill for the army. Ah, come on army water boy, it's not that bad. You wanna know how bad it is? It's so Okay, we're gonna go ahead and put Army Waterboy away for a little bit. So yes, I am currently on my two week for the National Guard, but that doesn't stop the vlog king from doing his vlog thing, you know what I'm saying? Oh my god. What? That was clever. Mm -hmm. So with that, uh, I actually still have some footage that is left over from Montana that I haven't shown yet because there's just so much of it. So we're gonna do the end of the Montana trip and then we'll go to current weekend. Yeah. I'm good at this. Okay, here we go. Hey guys, so it's currently, uh, oh gosh, vacation. My days get all messed up. It's Friday right now um, and we are officially out of Glacier National Park. And now we're actually in Missoula, Montana. And this is like a big college town. They have a bunch of breweries and stuff. So we're here checking out a bunch of breweries. First brewery that we're looking at today is called Kettle House Brewing Company. Take a look at the outside here. Fancy stuff. First brewery, blah, blah. It's a second. First brewery was a success is what I was going to say, Kelly. Let me finish. See, that's the thing, man. Girls don't like to let you speak very much. They always saying you're wrong, trying to fix the grammar. But in reality, you the one that's right. Second brewing company is Big Sky Brewing Company, located in Montana, U.S. of A. <laughs> all right. So we're currently at this brewery, and first of all, no seating, just standing, standing only. Secondly, you can't buy beer here because apparently it's too big of a brewery, like too popular. So they give you. Four free samples, and that's like all you get. So, sample sizes better be pretty darn good and pretty darn big, or you're gonna have one angry water boy. So, uh, here's our sample size. Actually, a pretty good, like, size sample, and you get four of them for free, so I won't complain too much. All right, with uh, Big Sky Brewing Company, a little weird, a little unorthodox, not what I'm used to, but that's fine. I'm, I'm always. Always good to roll with the punches. Beer was decent. Uh, atmosphere was a little weird. I didn't like that you couldn't like sit. Um, yeah. On to the next one. I believe it's called Highlander Brewing Company, which earlier we went to a antique shop. Kelly, may you hand me my can? I found this beauty. Uh, as you can see, it's a old beer can from none other than Highlander Beer. Uh, I'm expecting nothing less than perfection from this brewing company since I purchased one of their cans. I think Highlander Brewing Company is gonna have in store for us, Brian Jack. All right. Look, we're not the only parents that bring their babies to breweries. <laughs> okay. See, pulled up to the Highlander Brewing, and this place is like literally packed. Like, cars parked all along the street. Uh, I think it's for the brewery. I guess we'll find out. But it looks pretty busy. Definitely gets the best vote for the breweries that we went to today, correct, Cal? Sure. Sure. So we just got back from all the brewery visits, and we're back at our hotel here, and we're gonna go see the pool with Brayden. Brayden's first time in the pool, and wait till we see your swimsuit. It's pretty sweet. All right, guys, look at his swimsuit. Check it out. It's the back. All right, you ready? Are you going to do action like that? No. <laughs> okay, buddy. Oh, he has no idea what's coming. <laughs> so what are you doing, Peter? Yeah, <laughs> yeah right? Good, I feel so good. Does it feel good? Does it feel good? Say hi. 
Senses. Let's dump them in the hot It's like the next Michael the Phelps. Tub kitty pool. Tub kitty pool. <laughs> guys so it's currently uh, Friday night here and we are on our way to a St. Cloud Rocks game they're like a they're like a semi-professional baseball team I believe right two people that's in college what did you call me it's an amateur baseball oh. league okay <laughs> say I'm no amateur I'm a pro that's what they call them though amateur is like blues oh, I don't know. well we're going to a baseball game the Northwoods League? Minor Easy. leagues. No, it's not a minor no, league team. Minor oh my god, you guys. It's, just, it's a baseball game! <laughs> We're going to a baseball game. We're going to a baseball game. It's uh, gonna be fun. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Check out the seats that I got us for the, uh, the game here. It's courtesy of Mixing It Up Bakery going to section E, row 7. E-Row 7, mixing it up donuts. Yeah, I got us front row seats for the game, you know. It's a part of being the water boy. You're welcome for the seats, by the way, guys. You're welcome. You're welcome. I got the tickets. No, I got the tickets. They gave them to me because I'm the water boy. They gave it to me because I'm the water boy dad. <laughs> you, you the water man. I'm the water man. <laughs> Well, uh, we didn't get the W tonight, but uh, that's all right. What do we lose? Two zip? Two nine. Two zip. Yeah, it would have been nice to get the W, but that's what you get when the water boy's not on your team. Sign what, me you up. Don't have a seatbelt on or what? Yes, I'm vlogging, dude. I don't get it. Anyway, as I was saying, St. Cloud rocks. If you want to win games and you want the water boy on your squad, you can give me a call. I'll consider it. We'll see. Is this, is this even real? So the other day, I, uh, I sent a message to our good friend Nathan King, who is flashback. Nathan King, here's the CD. Looks cool, so looks like it was country. Uh, I picked it up just to hopefully listen to it, and uh, let's, let's get real listening. Send a message to him because I thought, like, us finding his CD in a random little gas station in Montana and like listening it to it all the time. I thought it was a cool story, so I just uh, I sent a little message to him and just sh shared it with him. What I didn't expect though is one for him to reply, which he did, and two for us to have like an actual conversation for about two hours. I talked to Nathan King for like two hours. It was sweet. Seems like a really cool dude. And found out he actually told me that he is going to be in Minnesota. October 21st. I told him that Kel and I would be like going to the show or whatever and he said we should hang out after the show. Pretty sweet, pretty cool. So we might actually get to meet Nathan King, the guy that we listened to the CD in the car for like 16 hours. So that's pretty sweet. Kelly's very excited. Speaking of music, how'd you like that segue, huh? Chimpanzee ride, no segue. You guys, uh, a couple weeks ago, I forgot to mention this last week, but I said if we hit 30 likes on a video, Cal and I would be making a song together. Less than 24 hours later, we get over 30 likes on that video. So it would appear that Cal and I are making a song and we have already picked out the beat and we're already working on the song and it's already pretty sweet. I'm already excited for it. We we'll probably won't be able to post that till like after my two week is done. I'm done on August 27th and then we're gonna work on it for a little bit and then it should go up. I will keep you updated on it though because it's gonna be sick. I know you're excited. It's, it's cool. And guys, uh, that's, gonna, that's gonna be it for this week's vlog. It was difficult to edit the vlog and get it up in time because I'm at my two weeks, so sorry that it's a little late. But I really wanted to get a vlog out to you guys because I love you guys. Uh, otherwise, gang, that's all I got for you. Remember, stay true, be you. And I'll catch you later, gang.
bad. So tell me, what's your story? <laughs>